Hi there, welcome to the video. Now today we are going to answer the question, how often do you need to shave your head if you are going bald? So you have gone bald or you're going bald, your hair's falling out and you've decided, well done, you have decided to shave your head. But there seems to be a bit of a divided opinion on whether you should go with the short buzz cut or get the razor out like I do and go totally bold, nothing at all on there. I've seen a lot of YouTube videos about this, uh, a lot of comments, and of course there's even there's been loads of guys messaging me on Instagram, you know, with a few questions. And thank you so much for all your messages. Guys, if anyone's watching this and you wanna ask me anything at all, then go hit me up on the Instagram and I will be happy to help you out in any way that I can. So it seems like the basic divide in opinion here is, you know, how often should you shave it? If you go with the buzz cut, a lot of people are saying that, you know, you can shave it less often, it kinda looks better for longer, it's less maintenance and it's just easier. Now, me personally, I like to get the razor out, okay? This is the other side of the coin where you go with the full razor and you take it down to nothing, you know, the total skin, no hair at all. But a lot of guys are worried thinking that if you do that, you have to shave it every day or every other day. It's a lot more hassle and some guys just don't wanna do that. In all honesty, it's going to depend on person to person, yes. All bald heads, all people's male pattern baldness, okay, it's different, everyone's is different. For me personally, I've got a big pole patch here and it's going, you know, thin here. It's kind of like the whole thing just went at the same time. Some people, you know, this is awesome and thick, but the hairline goes back, 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 back very slowly. And so it's gonna be different for different guys. They're gonna like different looks or different looks might look better on them. I think for me personally, if my hair was just receding slowly like this, but I still had a thick head of hair on top, I would probably go with the buzz cut myself. But because this part here is very thin, I feel more comfortable, I feel more tidy, more clean when I just take it all off. Now I'm gonna show you a few pictures here and you can see what I'm talking about. This one here, I'm getting a lovely rabies injection. Yeah, don't be worried, I just got bitten by a dog. Um, and you can see there clearly that I've got more hair on the side here and it's looking you know, really thin in the middle, of course, because my hair's falling out. And so when I have this look, this is after about a week of not shaving the head. And uh, so obviously the hair on the side here is still really thick and dark. So it makes this part in the middle look super, super thin. And I just feel uncomfortable like that. I feel uncomfortable, I feel untidy, I feel unkept. And that's when the sort of worrying and that anxiety comes in. I'm thinking like, oh, people can, you know, see the hair on, on there falling out and you know, I don't want people to ask questions. And I'll admit, you know, it starts to make me feel self-conscious that way. So like I said, I like to keep it down much more. I've got another one here. This is actually a video. I'm feeding a goat in Thailand. And you can see that super clearly in the sun. This part here on the top of my head, really, really thin. And that again is about a week of not shaving my head. And so for me, um, that's just not an option. I, I really hate to let it go um, that long, a week. So personally, I shave my head every one or every two days. Now, unfortunately, when you do that, irritation can be a bit of a problem, but Again, I had another video there talking about the irritation and I actually made my own like cream to go on my head after I shaved it. And guys, so far so good. I'll make another video going into that more later. But so far so good, I'm really enjoying putting that on my head. It still feels good, it's not too shiny. And so there are ways to get around it. So if you're worried, oh, my head's gonna be really irritated and sore, guys, there's ways around it, don't worry. Now on the other side of the coin, you know, some guys just don't care, right? They're not that worried about it. They just take it down to the buzz and they feel more comfortable like that than they would if they had, you know, the long styled hair, but with a big bold patch or, you know, big receding parts here. Now, one thing I tried, and I just want to mention this here, is I did try this haircut, okay? Now this was uh, actually before I shaved all of my hair off. And you can see I went with, it's kind of funny when I think about it now, but what I tried to do was make it appear that the hair on top here was more than the hair on the sides, or at least the same. 
by keeping this on top to a sort of grade three and then bringing this right down to a zero guard. You know, like I said in previous videos, I had that like marine look on the go. And uh, guys, it just didn't work. Um, in fact, it made it look even more obvious. There's just no way to hide it. And again, you know, when I was trying to hide it like that, I knew it wasn't working and I just felt really uncomfortable all the time. So, to summarise this video, how often do you need to shave your head if you're going bald? For me personally, I say every one or two days, okay, nice and regularly. Keep it short because that way you're not worried about it, you're not thinking about it, you've got no hair to worry about, it's a complete clean slate. There's just nothing to worry about. That is the way to go for me. If you think differently or you've got another opinion, then let me know. Get in touch via the comments or send me a message on Instagram. I'd love to hear your opinions on this topic. I hope this video might have helped some of you guys out. If at the moment you're shaving your head sort of weekly, but you're still not 100% comfortable, try it out. Try to take it down to every sort of two days with the uh, Zero Guard or my preference, the Razor. Give it a try, see how you feel. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you liked it and some of you guys found it useful. This channel is here to help out as many guys as I can with dealing with boldness, okay, or they're not feeling confident about it. I'm just here to make videos to help you guys out and kind of just support the bold community in general. I'm really hoping to try to change people's perceptions of it, especially us guys, you know, I know how it feels. If that is something you're interested in, then please subscribe to the channel and stick around because there's plenty more videos to come. Thank you so much for watching this video. I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.